Hello, welcome to Pro Mixing and Mastering. Today I'm going to show you and teach you how to pan your vocals properly. Sometimes, whenever, especially whenever you are dealing with uh, praise uh, backings and choir backings, you find out that, you know, whenever you like play those, uh, the, the song in your car or in your phone, suddenly the vocals don't seem to be like one together. They seem to be like scattered and you wonder what is really happening. On my PC, they sound good, but when like you play them, in other uh, uh, systems, they like the vocals. Some of the vocals are in the background. They don't sound good. They are scattered. They are not like one. Well, the mistake that you might be making is panning. The way you are panning your vocals matters. For example, if you pan your vocals to 100% right, 100% right, 100% right, 100% right, uh, left, right, 100% or 80, 90. You see, what you're doing to your vocals is that your vocals are really getting wider. And the problem is the, the speakers, some of the speakers are not going to pick that uh, widening and that is going to uh, like overshadow some of the vocals and your mix is not going to uh, sound, especially the chorus is not going to sound intact. It's going to sound like uh, the vocals are not together or you did not do a good job when it comes to mixing i want to play something a section on this one and i want you to like take a listen then i'm going to explain to you what i did and how i panned these vocals <laughs> All right, what I did is if let's say these are these are this is auto, the auto uh, backings I recorded like four four backings and basically you can use this trick for your choir and praise so that your vocals can sound better what i did was avoiding to take the uh take take the panning them to 100 percent left and right completely almost uh, like almost the voc almost all the vocals like panning left right 100 percent 100 percent sometimes doesn't really work out especially when you want your vocals to be like intact so what i did was I panned the auto to 60% so that it can be like a little bit on the middle, a little bit so that the vocal can just be there and every speaker can like pick up this vocal and not just to the left or to the right. Let me do this, solo it and just take a listen to this. So you can like get a listen to it in the headsets or in your phone, it can still be heard. Then the other uh, auto left, I panned it left 60%. So these two are like same auto left 60%, 60% so that it can be like just like medium, a little bit medium. Then the other autos, I put them on 42 42 is like near to the center and so i wanted these autos to be like near to the center so that they can be heard in almost every system so 42 60 is a good number 42 is a good number especially when you want your vocals to be like one and then the other auto the the other the soprano i put 85 just a little bit to the far but not 90 or 100 but 85 and but the, at the same time they'll still be be heard in uh, other speakers for example when i do this you hear it uh play um this this part i mean this part can still be heard right yeah so what we want is to get your vocals like to create that spectrum where your vocals will still be heard in almost every system including your cell phone and then uh these are soprano soprano i panned 85 85 then these are tenors 42 again 42 why i just want them to be like closer to the middle of the speaker so whenever you put them closer to the middle of the speaker the vocals sound one and then we have uh the other tenors 
45, these ones are 45, these ones are 42, then these ones I gave them 45, 45, so that they can still sound one. Don't make a mistake by taking your tenor to 100%, then the other tenor to 100% left or right, and then the other tenors you take them to maybe uh, 90, 90, they are gonna sound far away from each other and they're not gonna be one when you play your your chorus in the system in any system it's like gonna sound uh you know unprofessional and these are other male autos the male auto female autos i mean i pan them 51 and 51 like half half you see so each vocal like 60 42 45 and 51 is or 50 is a good number when it comes to panning your vocals then these others i pan them 45 again then uh these are other autos like the auto number three this is like another auto that i had to put uh in the vocals and because i i have one two three autos male female then the other autos what i did was these ones i had to pan them to 100 percent uh right and 100 percent left because i already have the other autos which are like supporting on the middle so once you like realize these are like okay i already have those ones which are 42 42 closer to the middle so what i'm gonna do what am I gonna do with these the rest of these autos? I'm gonna just send them to the left and right speaker and that is not gonna affect in fact that is gonna really balance up everything because uh the vocals are gonna be like on the middle, some of them are gonna be like left and right speaker. Then the other male auto, these are male autos, I pan them 50-50. So here we go, we have hundred hundred they are far away from each other i didn't want them to be like far away from each other so what i did is i calculated the next of male autos are supposed to be 50 50 so when like you put 50 50 and then 100 100 like everything gets balanced think of yourself like on a seesaw whereby you get somebody who is 100 kg and then you put someone who is like a 5 kg like it's not gonna be balanced right but when you put somebody 50 who's 50 kg and 50 kg the seesaw is really gonna work out the way it is supposed to work out that's a balance so always uh watch out for these numbers 100 100 if you pan two vocals 100 100 then the next must be 50 50 and then if you pan the the others on others on uh let's say um 42 42 then others must be 45 45 then if you pan others on 85 then the others must be at least on 51 so basically this is how you achieve this uh oneness and i hope this video has helped you and if it has helped you don't forget to like it and also uh subscribe and share